The Boer War was supposedly seen by the British as a white man's war. It was not having an Indigenous involvement, actually. When they sent people over in the States, there were Indigenous Australians who were actually in units within Australia. People f tend to forget that Indigenous Australians were in uniform since the 1860s in this country. So there were Indigenous Australians in light horse units. It's as part of AATSA's national responsibility to maintain and preserve a collection of material and records that celebrate and uh, enhance the contribution of Indigenous Australians to the nation building. The photo is extremely significant because records uh, about Indigenous involvement, uh, certainly in the Boer War, are very rare and uh, in, in, there's a major challenge in trying to demystify uh, Indigenous involvement in all conflicts, but particularly uh, the Boer War represents a particular challenge and here we have irrefutable evidence of Indigenous involvement in this conflict. These men would have come out of a community, they would have basically joined the military, served overseas as part of that unit as, as an equal, then they would have come back to Australia and probably disappeared back into their community because these people didn't get to march. You know, they went back to community, they were controlled by whatever Indigenous agency in that state controlled them um, and they just vanished. So no one knows about them, only community. So it just, it just, they just become legends in a sense and it disappears. Um, and really it's only probably been in the last 20 years that people have actually tried to find these people. Um, but it's been too late, we left it too late. In the reflection that goes with the celebration, if you like, or recognition of the centenary of, of Gallipoli, it's particularly also important that records, uh, as rare as this photo is, uh, are gathered and preserved and protected. It's very rare to find a photo of Indigenous servicemen in the Boer War. It's very rare. It's hard to find them in the Second World War. So it's a great record, not just from an Indigenous perspective, but from a national perspective, it's a wonderful record of Indigenous contribution in the Boer War conflict. We've been in everything, you know, and people don't know about it, so we need to get the faces up there and get the stories up there. These men are serving their country. They are serving country, you know, whether it's Australia or their chunk of country, and be proud of them. The rest of Australia needs to know about them, you know. Um, have a think about this. We're not citizens, and yet we're willing to die for this place. And we're willing to die for non-Indigenous Australians. Have a think about that one. Mm -hmm.